Hello and welcome to this introduction to the Elphic App Optimizer. The origins of the uh, Elphic App Optimizer is to answer four business problems. The first one being uh, bandwidth saturation. We need to do more with less and the problem with rich media content websites which has become in the last three to five years the majority of the websites is that the same internet links that are in place which have not been upgraded uh, are being used a lot more for the same daily activities strictly because of the nature of the internet has dramatically changed low and undesirable traffic is the second reason why organizations are looking to control uh, what's happening because not every application being used on the organization is actually something desirable. Peer-to-peer uh, -peer traffic is a good classic example of traffic that organizations may not want to allow completely or or some organizations may want to throttle certain traffic types um, or just give a limited amount of bandwidth like iTunes would be a good example. Legal and compliance issues can be a very big topic where the transfer of copyrighted materials over peer-to-peer -peer networks is a classic but very uh, valid example which is found daily across the world of uh, in the business world and public sector. So this is something that organizations are looking to control. And budgets. How can we get more out of our current investment? So. The Alpha Cap Optimizer will provide three core functionalities and benefits to the organization. The first one being application identification. So it has the ability to detect over 575 applications. So the Alpha Cap Optimizer can actually effectively detect the traffic type of uh, any session being transferred over your ISP links. Once that is uh, the traffic is identified, we can actually apply uh, control over uh, the said traffic. So we can either throttle or promote uh, desirable traffic or you know, let's say medium to high uh, priority traffic through QoS rules and for the low or undesirable traffic going back to the example of the peer-to-peer -to, -peer to transfer copyrighted material we can literally drop the traffic from the network and no longer it can uh, it can be uh, utilized. And lastly reporting because organizations don't necessarily have good visibility into their bandwidth and what their bandwidth is being used for. An example of a set of policies that can be deployed, uh, first and foremost, looking at key business traffic, looking at virtual desktop applications like Citrix and Desktop, that's perfectly valid and very uh, much uh, important to an organization. Sky, because we nowadays talk over voice over IP with our USB headset to customers over the internet. Uh, McAfee, because security patches and updates are very important. Windows update because of the same reasons. Email, we don't need to go too, uh, too far with this one. And on the flip side of the coin, if we want to look at cloud applications, we want to make sure that we're able to communicate with the cloud applications with the right amount of, th of bandwidth. A good example would be salesforce.com. Low priority traffic, which can still be allowed, but uh, throttle down so it doesn't take out all the traffic that we want to use, uh, that we the, all the bandwidth that we have in place. Microsoft Instant Messenger, iTunes, YouTube uh, would be good examples. Uh, another one can be Netflix if uh, your organization wants to allow it or simply drop it like we can drop BitTorrent, Mega Upload, Farmville and so many others. So that's a quick summary example of what it can look like. So if we want to bring that back to the Elphic Link Balancer product line, we now offer complete bandwidth management and this is a very exciting uh, opportunity for organizations out there to be able to deliver a complete uh, bandwidth management project at a very reasonable uh, budget level. First benefit we bring to the table is the ability to run multiple ISPs, fixed or wireless, for business continuity. So if ISP A or B fails, ISP C is still there to make sure your business is still connected because if your business is unconnected, you're losing money by the minute. ISP load balancing, because we've got multiple ISPs in place, let's share the load and let's uh, bring a lot more throughput to the table for all users and applications. Application level traffic management is the Elphic app optimizer, which we discussed. 
And we also bring site-to-site uh, -site resilience with our uh, site path MTPX feature. Common applications are for site-to-site -site VPNs and site-to-site -site voice server IP. And we have the ability also to deliver complete multi-site business continuity disaster recovery planning style projects to LFX unique Geolink technology. Now let's take a look at what the uh, LFX app optimizer looks like. The Elphic App Optimizer module is available through the web interface in the wizard section of the Link Balancers Management web interface. And the first thing that will be given to the user is the ability to actually analyze the traffic that's being uh, handled through all the ISPs uh, connected to the Elphic Link Balancers. So all the applications are classified by category type. So as a few examples we highlighted right now, we have messaging, we have peer-to-peer, -peer, we have remote access, we have social networking. So organizations can actually drill into what they really need to see based on applications, based on groups, based on what they want to look for. Now, reports are available on the right side on for both the groups and the individual applications. And as to create the rules to, uh, to process traffic, in the App Optimizer Action Rules tab, we simply add a rule. And now there's going to be a third rule created in this uh, link balancer that we're using for the demonstration today. And we can choose by either the group or the application. So in this example, I will create a common rule that's being requested is peer-to-peer. -peer, and I will simply go into Drop and I will go save and from there the link balancer will identify and drop all peer-to-peer -peer traffic for the organization. As a second example of a rule that we can create, we can simply go for what's important for the organization. So if we're in a heavy file transfer organization, um, like a printing organization, we can go into the uh, the file transfer group and from there apply the rule as an example we can do classify the Elfic link balancer has the ability to manage QoS queues so we simply select a queue based on our policies and our preference and we can do it as such or we can drill down to make sure that go to meeting which is really important for an organization's web presentations we want to make sure that that application has enough bandwidth we can apply the same kind of logic Thank you very much for viewing this webcast on the Alpha App Optimizer. For more information, we invite you to access uh, online resources, namely alphic.com forward slash app optimizer for more information on the product itself, alphic.com forward slash demo to have the ability to go out and try an Alpha unit live on the internet and actually play with the user interface, uh, where our phone lines are, of course, open at 888-GO-ELFIC or 514-667-0611, option one. Or you can just email us at, at info at and we'll respond to your request within 24 hours. Thank you very much and have a great day.